everybody you get to see my cat here i hope you can see he's curled up today's wednesday the 9th of march and i realized that next week monday there is no class even though today in class i said i'll see you on monday it's monday the 21st so i didn't want to uh wait a whole 10 days before saying this this is the last circuit from today's class this here was written as the load load resistor and if and when there's a load resistor for Tevinon, we just consider it and we assume that the terminals a and b are around it this is the same thing we did on monday uh let's find the Tevinon voltage here and later we're gonna find the norton current <clears throat> and for class um, you were asked to find the um, uh, Tevinon or Norton resistance using the test source method. So that is up to you. So I'm going to draw the circuit that I'm expecting to have to solve for VTH. So for VTH, I leave the load off and I do not short, that is, I open these two here, terminals A and B. So it's to my advantage to make B ground. And now, oh, instead of A, I'm going to call this C because otherwise it's called VA also. So this guy is already VA, so I'm going to call this VC. Therefore, VC will be my VTH. In general, it is the voltage. It's this voltage here, right? VCB is the VTH. It's also called VOC, the open circuit potential. Now look, um, <clears throat> there is uh, nothing connected to this 2VA power supply. So really the circuit is just this one loop. It's minus 12, 4k and 2k so <clears throat> the current here there is only one current in the circuit and that current is going to be 12 divided by 6k which is 2 milliamps and therefore va because it's 2 milliamps going that way times 4k will be 8 volts so the voltage across the 2k here will be 4 volts which is also i is 2 milliamps times 2k um, and now i am done because 2va which is oops, sorry which is the voltage supply there the dependent power supply will be equals to 2 times 8 volts it's 16 volts and this 2va means that um, from here to here, there's 16 volts. And now I, I want to find VC. And just like what we did in the beginning of this class, um, I gave you a, a how, to find, how to find voltage drops. If this is VC and this is VB, I'm going to start from the arrow here and I'm going to follow the circuit to the tail. So it's like this, minus 16 plus 4. it will be minus 12 volts. That's the VTH. Now in the next video, I'm going to find IN. But I'm going to write here, Tevinon voltage, VTH is minus 12 volts. If I were drawing the Tevinon equivalent, it would have been with a plus on the top, and here's 12 volts, and then I'm still in need of finding, you know, this is the tech. I'm still, you know, missing the RTH, which is um, what I'm asking you guys to do. And then next video, we're going to find IN, which is going to go here.